I think Phuket has some of the best places in the world to go cruising. And what I enjoy the most is to go straight from my home, so I can keep my boat right at the back. And on the spur of the moment, like today is a beautiful day, so I have friends in the morning, we have a couple of Bloody Marys and jump on the boat. And we're in PP Island in half an hour, or in Pangna Bay, or Krabi in half an hour, and that's the thing I can't enjoy that anywhere else in the world, you know. Until a few years ago, import duty on yachts was 220%. And I loved this place, so I met the ex Prime Minister Taksin in 2002 and told him, I said, you've got the best cruising grounds in the world. But there are two problems. Import duty on the boats is too high and there are no good marinas. I said, if you drop the import duty down to zero, I'll build a world-class marina and it's going to attract a lot of affluent tourism to Phuket because at that, in those days there were a lot of backpackers and so on. So now there's a lot of luxury tourism, people from billionaires, some of the mega yachts and so on. And not only Royal Phuket Marina is full, but every other marina is completely full. So we're expanding our marina to accommodate more boats. So people are bringing the boats. It is now duty free. A lot of people don't know. But since 2004, you can bring your boat in duty free. But if you keep it here, to charter it out, you have to pay 7% VAT, which is very low. The fuel here is half the price of it in Europe. Crew cost is less than half. It's one of the few places in the world you can go cruising all the year round. So we invest a lot of money in the yacht. You don't see it lying six months in dry dock. And you can only use it six months and you're still paying the captain the salary and so on. So this is one of the few places. And mooring costs are cheaper than anywhere else in Europe. More and more affluent people are coming in and yacht owners just find this a paradise because you can go to so many. I mean, so Phuket is surrounded by over 30 beautiful islands. Each one is better than the other. So within two hours, you can be in 30 different islands. And within three or four hours, you're in Malaysia on one side, and on the other side you have Burma, and a little further away you've got Andaman Islands in India. So you can go to so many different places from Phuket, not only Phuket itself has beautiful islands in Thailand and surrounding areas, so there's so much to see. Royal Phuket Marina has won several awards. In fact, it's the only marina in Asia that's got a four gold anchor award from UK, which gives all the facilities only given to five star marinas. These villas where you can have a boat behind your villa, because this is the only development in Asia where you can have your yacht right behind. So whenever you feel like going on the boat, you just go on the boat. 